we're gonna add up to our ranked. Hey, Reva, how's it going, girl? Hey. <laughs> Also, if you have a telescope, uh, Uranus is visible too, um, just near the, <laughs> did I say that? Near, your, near the horizon. I'm gonna stick with uh, weather. Okay, uh, it looks like that circulation, that tornado is between Morris and Seneca. And, and is it raining heavily around you now? Yeah, and the wind's blowing really heavily, like it's a blast from Howard Stern's asshole. Oh. Had to have one of those, didn't you? What did you think about today? Oh my god, the last two days were fucking. Now explain this outfit. What? Explain this outfit. The last two games were amazing. Yeah, right. So you can see everyone's having a really good time here tonight. Do you know how this fire started? Yes, I do. It was because of my cousin. And I don't want to mention no names. Your cousin? Yes. Um, and you say you think your cousin started this. Uh, do you know how or why? He's mad because he couldn't. He can't get with me. I'm married to my husband. And it's a long story. Just make it short. Yeah. I had to park my car and meet there because I couldn't go nowhere. Because I seen the tree limbs and stuff like flying everywhere. Tree limbs. You know what I'm saying? Like from the trees. Tree limbs from the trees. Who do? All right. On to other stories. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> this afternoon, Sleppard storms. There was a report of a tornado touching down her Fury County. Oh man, it, it all went down, man. I stayed right next door, man, from the thing that happened, man. The barbecue, man. I was barbecuing, man. I seen some fire just come out all out the window, man. The window busted out, man. Only thing I think first, man, make sure them ribs is right. And I ran them and got my family, man. Brung everybody out safely, man. I carry everybody out myself, man. You know what I mean? Keep this PG, everybody myself, man. I did that. Feel me? Did I get any injuries? Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, nah, I ain't get no injuries and stuff except for the, all the smoke in my lungs and stuff. I already had smoke in my lungs, so I, I'm all right. So I'm out here with Jocelyn Whitehead, who is a family friend of the male victim who was shot earlier today. And Jocelyn, what did he say? He was like, now nah, all I heard was saying, help me, help me. I got to pee. Oh, that's what he said? I got to pee. Oh. I'm going to pee myself. Do you know where he was shot at on his body? Um, I think in, um, in... in in his head right there. So he was shot on the arm, an arm in his leg, or arm in his stomach? I just peed on myself. Oh, it's okay, don't worry about it. But, I'm wet. No, so um, afterwards, can you describe to people who don't know him, and his name was Michael, you said? I think, huh? I think his name was Michael. Mike? <gasps> okay, we'll be right back. Get out of here, shut the fuck up. Exactly now, the girl, the guy, we have about 200 kids that will run a mile this morning as well. That is so cute. All right. That's ESPN NFL insider John Clayton with the uh, insight and the latest for us on SportsCenter. To push him out of business, and she doesn't think that he can operate fairly. Good morning, John and Randy. I can tell you that I just learned that about 35 people from the uh, assisted living facility have been transported to Mercy Jefferson Hospital. Well, we were uh, have pretty much evacuating the building. We were waiting for the children to finish the evacuation. Watch yourself, watch yourself. Heads up, heads up, heads up, heads up, heads up, heads up. Heads up. You do not want to be out here joyriding. Uh, VDOT is asking folks to uh, stay off the roads, and, uh, and, and that helps them move along quicker here. But if you can take a look at the road here, uh, obviously the buffoonery has returned. But uh, Yeah, Marnie, we were right in the middle of it when that violence occurred earlier. One of the Seattle police officers came down on his bike. We got a guy here dancing around. This is pretty similar to what we've seen tonight, but I would prefer dancing rather than some of the violence and some of the other property damage that we've seen tonight. Seattle police have them hemmed in. 
Sir, let me tell your story. Seattle police have them hemmed in here and are allowing them to express their message um, as long as they stay in this area. Just over my shoulder here and just past my friend there is where they had the fire last year in the middle of the intersection that shut down the traffic. Tonight, they are not letting anybody downtown as far as protesters are concerned. Cannot repeat the advice often enough from the Gardaí. Don't make unnecessary journeys. Don't take risks on treacherous roads. And don't swim in the sea. Incredible people have been spotted in the water here in Black Rock and Salt Hill both today and yesterday. Galway City Council say their actions are idiotic. Not only are they putting their lives in danger, but it is unacceptable and unforgivable to put the lives of people in the rescue services at danger as well. Nem tudom, hogy tudom, hogy for... Körülbelül 140 kilométeres sebességet, de hihetetlen. A couple of minutes, uh, it's really picked up. I think that's an understatement. It's uh, raining quite a lot in Foxborough. Before it was raining this heavily, we managed to talk to a couple of fans who had an opinion or two about uh, what was going on. The proper way to sled down a hill that's more muddy than snowy, they say no matter what, just have fun, use your hands, and make sure you steer. Oh, boy. <gasps> already this morning just flying by like this week it's wednesday right i think so hump day yeah, um, yeah we're getting there hopefully we'll have a dry hump day it's not real oh he's standing in front of the net with about eight inches of his shaft in his hand and i uh, thought nothing will ever be as cool as crystal meth pepsi an absolutist monarchy or personality cunt and cut personality cult. He's actually one week ahead of schedule from when he had back surgery on his herniated disc. He was supposed to come back in eight weeks. And it's likely one of those international cities might stop. We're working here, man. How you doing? Who's going to win this battle of the lumberjacks? That's going to be I'm putting my money on Clayton. Of course, LeBron bringing a lot of sex success to Cleveland, but just not enough. Not quite not enough. Quite This is BBC News, I'm Carol Walker. When on space missions, astronauts get used to eating freeze-dried foods, but today there's something fresh. Gotta say, it seems like a better idea than eating food grown on Uranus. Uh, let's take a look at the game of the night. Time once again to get you caught up on your news headlines. For that, the Hamburglar. <laughs> it's your birthday, I'll let it pass. No, I won't. I'll get you later. Daniel, charter boat captains say the new restrictions would just be too much, but Marine Fisheries Committee members, excuse me, don't agree. <clears throat> the new restrictions would come in the form of a law. <laughs> I apologize. All right, okay. All right. Look be, at you know that way we'll I'm right looking. Back. I'm looking. I want to see that. Yeah, you would. She can we'll really back. relax her sphincter or whatever that's called. Is that a sphincter, Phil? This is where I weigh <laughs> out. Whatever it is, she's re relaxing it. And McClellan, or uh, Jim's wife, uh, Janet, uh, says McCall uh, says that she, for his, uh, it, so that he would get better. That period of uh, uh, lost for words here. And we've been the food truck, food truck fanatic all week long. Food truck. What'd you say? Food truck fanatic. That's what I meant to say. Gulp. High five lunch truck is here with yeah, us. Yeah, high five yourself for that. Oh boy. Oh. It's not uh, easy being Ray. <clears throat> uh, Ray HR line one. Just so you know. Amazon is now worth more than the nation's biggest retailer. The online store is currently valued at $264 billion. At last check, Walmart was valued at $234 billion. You know why? Wow. 
because they sell sex toys and Walmart can't or won't sell sex toys. Amazon does. A friend of mine works in the uh, warehouse. He says they sell a ton of them. Yeah. I'm just telling you how it is. Uh, They're trying to eat breakfast. Well, yeah, but nobody else will tell you this, but that's the reason. Okay. Uh, Aaron Rodgers has been uh, downright perfect. Years ago, my good, Sheriff, measles was virtually eradicated.